after. Good, can I get a yogurt parfait? Probably not. Okay. Well, as you can already tell, I'm in the airport. Five seventeen AM. I'm going to Texas today. Going fishing with Rob, John, one ride, one reel, but no AP. Thank God. I don't know how much like in the airplane I'm gonna film or like in the airport or anything. I didn't film like anything this morning, and I think you guys know why. I got kicked off the flight for filming. They literally kicked me off the flight. So with that being said, enjoy the vlog. Six hours later. It's currently 9.21 a.m. As you can see, I'm not in Texas. What happened was, is about like 7 a.m. Uh, so we, had, we sat on the runway for like an hour. Something was wrong with the plane, we don't really know. And so they spent an hour trying to fix it. Could not do it. So they made everybody get off the plane. I had to go downstairs and wait in a line for two hours. Get on a new flight, and I believe this one takes off at 11:50. So my original flight was 6 a.m. Now it's 11:50. So right now I'm just sitting in the airport, doing some math homework, watching YouTube videos, having a great time flying American Airlines. Bunkers TV. Hey, what's going on? What's going on? John B. Bunkers TV. Well, I, I mean, my flight was supposed to land here at 8, so I'm pretty much on time. No, you're pretty good. It's only if you guys can't see, it's only 318. American Airlines is where it's at. If any guys are looking to fly anywhere, I'd really suggest them. <laughs> Yeah, so going back to the American Airlines, you know, I don't really bash on any companies. I, I don't I don't really talk bad about any companies. Not a fan, Cabela's. Not a fan. Brands are junk. Do not get a motor guy trolling motor. But I mean, I'm going to be completely honest, American Airlines is garbage. So I'm just going to leave that there for any guys that are looking to travel. Well, that lady broke the toll. So we're currently going in reverse. <laughs> Did you see that? That's what you're doing, Chrysler. <laughs> so, Chi, I don't know if you guys could see that, but basically, like, good a muffler was like completely off of the car, just dragging. Like, it sounded like it's like pop cans. That's how you get. It's, the... It sounded like pop cans getting dragged behind a car. That is how you get the best MPG out of your view. <laughs> oh gosh, it's burnt. Man, oh god, I lost. A, I lost a flop. Where'd my Where'd my shoe go? Oh, we got boosted board. Ride this thing around the parking lot. We're back in business. We're going to Bass Pro Shops. Lunkers TV. And uh, John, look at them kicks though. God damn. Dude, check out those gills. You guys can't price anything. They're just getting some dope shots right here. Get the waterfall B roll. Yeah, I'm picking up my new boat today. You're gonna take tow it with the. the tip, tip tow it? You're gonna tow it with the car? Yeah. It's my new boat. Taking it home. So, if you guys are wondering why we're at Bass Pro, John B's picking out a new boat. Take back to Illinois, go crush some ponds. Since we can't go fishing, I'm just gonna take this back with us. So Rob is buying a fly fishing rod and reel. He's looking to get into fly fishing. So that's what we're doing. We're buying fly fishing stuff. Just uh just chilling with my new my new buddy Pat. That's my buddy Pat. Everyone go subscribe to his channel. I'll put the link, put the link down below. His uh his vids are pretty fire to be honest. If you think John B's vids are fire, that dude throws down some dope edits. I'm buying all these by the way. Hey, we need some it's, four, uh... it's 445. These guys spent like four hundred dollars a piece on fly fishing stuff. We need it though. You, We're gonna learn need... how to fly fish. That's what I need, that's what I want to do. They're gonna learn how to fly fish. At least Rob is. I think John. John already knows. We're getting swim baits, swim bait hooks. Yep, that's pretty much it. That's 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 about it. Um, 
Oh yeah. Those are weighted though. Those will work though. But we need those. What you think about? We got we got swim bait hooks. We gotta find some swim baits now. Swim baits. We need, you know what? We need a swim bait. I'm gonna grab some rivets. All right, we're gonna we're gonna. I want to fish some top water tomorrow as well as some space. We're gonna get rock some rivets. These are pretty cheap. They look they look these. Let's see if we'll see tomorrow if they hold up right. fairly well. Oh. What's up? You can catch something on one of these. The bullworm, dude. That thing's massive. Well, you, this makes me just want to buy them just to try them. That's literally like a pack of gold. Dude, can you can you will you buy some of these? Let's try some of these. Come on. Why? Because gold lipless cranks work really well. It, oh, so those will work really well since you gold know. lipless crank mates work. Let's try them. Let's see, you want to try them? Sure. Right. That's uh, John B. getting some dope B-roll footage. I came here intending to not buy any lures and I ended up getting like probably 50 bucks worth. So that's usually what happens when you come to Bass Pro Shops. But uh, we're, we're about to go check out. We got to go pick up Mike, the Goose Slayer. That's the shot. Let's see these. Broke in the Midwest. <laughs> John B is broke. Spent 600 bucks at Bass Pro Shops. I spent 44. Hey, uh, hey, John. Do you want to give people an update? You need to get a wider lens, bro. It's like, hey guys, welcome to another episode of Fishing with Flair. <laughs> Today, my nose is in the frame. Uh, what do you That's want me why to say? Yes, have the wide angle. Explain like what, where we're going, and why. We are currently going to. Dallas, or we're going to Love we're going to Love Field right Dallas. now. We were supposed to go to DFW, but one rod, one reel. Um, AKA Mike said AKA said, that, said that said that Rob said to fly into Love, and then wow. Rob does not recollect um, telling him to do so. So we're driving 30 minutes um, away from DFW, where we all landed at, and uh, we're going to pick up um, Goose Hunter. Uh, Goose Hunter 99. Yeah. Goose Hunter 99. <laughs> That's his new uh, channel name, you guys. So in case you're curious, Goose Hunter 99, subscribe. Here you go. We found Goose Slay McGee. Hey, I don't know how we're gonna fit all this stuff in here. Behind the scenes of one rod, one goose fishing. Mike, 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 Mike. Where are we going? We're going pod fishing, right? Where are we going? Miss me with that. <laughs> <laughs> not gonna fit. Oh, they're gonna fit. Yeah, well, it'll fit. We're gonna have to make it fit. We're gonna make. We're gonna make it fit. Mike, do you have anything to say to the fans? Here? Well, I told my sub they'd be catching a 10 pounder today, but uh, looks like we're not fishing. A little disappointing. Let's go check Flay. Oh my goodness gracious! What time is it? Well, somehow we made it. Seven o'clock. Thanks to uh, well, not not that guy. Actually, thanks to. Where did they go? There he is. Thanks to that guy, it's seven o'clock, just getting to uh, Rob's place. So we're gonna unload, we're gonna unpack. That's Rob's boat. Maybe get some fishing stuff ready, do a live stream possibly, and eat beef stroganoff. Like, yeah, it doesn't matter anymore. I want to do work. Rob. Fire it! Fire it! Ah! Dude, I was in Texas for one minute. We're gonna get bit by a fire. Are you sure? Where are the fire ants at? I don't know, he's got bit by one now. He's such hey. a, he's full of it. I swear, dude, I swear. <laughs> That's what he gets right there. <laughs> First the goose, now the ants. What's next, Mike? What's next? So, you saw we went to Bass Pro Shops. I kind of went through what I got, but I'm, I'm going to do like a quick little, little recap. I just got a few things. So, Rob was saying they're eating swim baits, therefore, bought some swim baits, some more swim baits, some swim bait hooks. Uh, another swim bait hook, got some rivet toad things, and then for some stupid reason we got some uh, dream shot, basically some drop shot baits. And then, last but not least, we got the uh, 24 karat gold biffle bugs. If I'm going to catch a 10 pounder on anything, it's going to be one of these dudes right here. So it's basically, whoa. So it's basically all I got, not a ton of stuff. We're going to go inside, smash on some grub. It is eight o'clock and we are wrapping up the day. John B's over there getting rigged up. One Rod's getting rigged up. Lunker's TV's getting rigged up. We got a bunch of stuff. I'm gonna show you, I've got four lures tied on for the morning. I'm gonna show you those. And then tomorrow you'll see the actual, like the actual like fish. We got one, one, one swim bait. I've got a frog, topwater frog. I've got a weight, weightless Senko that's not focusing. And then a whopper plopper that's covered by a little bait glove. So that's basically all I've got. In case you guys are wondering what, what Mike's using, he's just already going into it. So let's come over here. And I got my topwater rod. And we got Rob's gear right here. We got Flair vlogging right there. What's up? 
And we got John, who's not even close to being rigged up. Nope. He's, uh, he's way behind. One hour later. So, Rob, Rob, Rob just finished. Whoa. Rob, Mike, <laughs> and, uh, whoa, where's John B? John B's cranking out the fire edits right now. We just finished up dinner, Rob's house. We've got Rob's unboxing to do. Are we still live streaming? So we're not live streaming anymore. John doesn't have any baits rigged up. I've got those four baits. Everybody else got like five or six baits. What time are we getting up, Rob? Three. We're getting up at 3 a.m. John's already crying. As long as I've got White Monster, I'll be good to go. So we're getting up at 3 a.m., driving three hours to Lake X. We're gonna catch Giants. Mike's obviously gonna catch a 10 pounder because that's what he does every single time he goes fishing in Texas or Florida or Maryland or anywhere in the United States. And I will catch a big fish as well. I'm gonna say hi, puppy. Hi, puppy. All right, this vlog was not that bad. It just, it really sucked when your flight is supposed to leave at six and then leaves at one. And you don't do anything. And you don't do anything. I sat there and I did math homework and I watched PewDiePie videos. Like that's literally how I spent my day. PewDiePie! You wanna do that one more time? PewDiePie! But I made the made the most of it. So if you guys enjoyed this, uh, we will be fishing the rest of the week, Tuesday, Wednesday. I'm flying back Thursday, but I will be doing some fishing when I get back. Just have to take some, you know, really good college tests because college education is important. John, you wanna you wanna sign out on this joint? I mean, you can throw you can throw this if you want. Okay, guys, keep fishing, never stop. Oh wait, oh wait, hold on, wait. Oh wait, hold on, oh hold on, give me a second. Oh wait, give me a second, give me a second, give me a second. That's good, you can cut that off. <laughs> Peace.